um, almost live, and now we're live. Now we're live. Super pumped, you guys. Today, I'm going to do one of my favorite insects, a bumblebee. Hashtag save the bubble bees. There's just something about a fluffy bee that shouldn't even be flying that can take its big old booty off the ground that I find insanely endearing. And I'm going to paint one today. All right, we got Roxy, Nene, Susan. <gasps> Nene got the dragonfly. Nene, congratulations on your purchase today. We thank you very much for that. Shane, what's happening? How to do? El Spicy. Olay. El Spicy, I feel like, I feel like for some reason, um, what, you have like a tiger thing for your picture. I feel like you should have like a, one of those awesome badass like uh what is it, the hispanic the mexican wrestler mask like something i don't know why but you have pizza in your name so i don't even know what that has to do with what do you what do you think about that And where are you from? What's happening, everybody? What's happening? Welcome, welcome. came up with a uh, I've been wanting a logo I've been wanting something that represents us and I've been like thinking about it for the past week um, it's funny because uh, I've been thinking about it but I just every now and again I'll forget or just, you know I don't really concentrate on it do something else um, I'm not trying to change the ATD logo but I want something that, you know, when people see it, they know what it is. So what I'll most likely do is put the ATD logo on it, but something that represents us. And I think I'm gonna do, um, I'm gonna do my version of the down view of a bumblebee. Um, Erica came up with it today, she's like, why don't you just do or i was like what 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 are we like what is it that if people saw it they would know at a word or an animal or something a symbol i wanted a symbol and she's like be um something else and i'm like well that's that's it like that's that's it a bee i mean we don't call each other bumblebee but we do call each other B, and it, I mean, it just, it makes sense. We're hardworking, we're colonized. Yeah, and we put our sting into everything. And if we put our sting in, then we die. Right? Maybe we just <laughs> Stinger. put just a tip in. Stinger. Worker bees. So yeah, I'm going to... Take uh, that crown. I'm gonna do some kind of like clip art style, like black and white silhouette type of something that, you know, and black and gold is one of my favorite two combo colors, so. That's true. Frenchie, any of the color passion colors work as the stone coat base tints do. So just hit up our website and look up color passion. All of those work like base tints. 
So no need to worry. Hey, Shelly. We, we, we got you covered. Um, babe, what are you going to do today? I'm going to do bubble baby. Are you sure? Shelly from Hubby's channel. Hope you all had an amazing day. Tink. Tink. Let's get to Shelly audience. from Within Resin. I guess that's... Yeah, it's Within Reason, but... Resin, resin or Reason? It's Resin, but that's the play, I think. Oh. As you can see here, I have printed off the Bumblebee because I stressed out so super hard on my... Um, proportions for the what was the thing I did of the hummingbird well, you um, did a great job there on it thanks Steve see this way you can show you can show people how easy it is no way to transfer it yeah so I'm just I'm using um, this transfer paper that Jeff has used quite a number of times I don't know if you can or carbon paper to transfer the image you can read this stuff. So what I want to do is make sure this is carbon side down. Not that it really matters how I turn this image because it's round. But I know I want to incorporate a hexagon as well. Here we go. See, that's why I want to. Uh... See, look at that. Look how large that is. If you if you put this over here like this, like, mm -hmm. but then when you put the it all the way, it goes small. Like, why is that? Whoa! Where did all the stuff go? You think they would? You could make it like the letters be bigger. Vintage monitors. What's happening? What's happening? What's up, Lisa? Yeah, Frenchie, just use a little bit. Just try it just a little bit. Um, it's the same as, um, as stone coats. You know, when you, you just put a little bit and just keep adding. You can always add more. You can't take out. So if you just joined us, what she's doing is she printed out the bumblebee that she wanted to use and she has carbon paper down. Is the carbon paper on the right side? I hope so. Huh? I well, so. check before you, before you outline that whole thing. I'm almost done, but yeah, the dark side's down. Well, look. No, you've got the wrong side down. How is it possible that this lighter side is the right that's side? Because that's the stuff. Unless you're just not pushing hard enough. You're just like tracing it? Yeah. Or were you? Were you just like lightly drawing over it? I was just regular drawing. But was it, was it going? Okay, that is, that's the dark side. But was it, is it on there? Yeah, but it's like super faint. Well, don't use, use this. Try to use this eraser. 
you always you always check. Do one line and then look to see what you've done and how dark it is. I wish I can like see that past English English So I'm gonna have to put a lot of pressure down apparently. Yeah, just but and you, why how come you're not taping it down? You need to like tape tape it down. Because if you move it a little bit, you're gonna your proportions would be all messed up. I'm about to throw alcohol like at this. It's gonna be all messed up anyways. Oh, you think? Yeah. I just need a guide. It doesn't have to be exact at all. Oh. Okay, well, I appreciate it. What you gotta do? Mm -hmm. See, just because I'm telling you what I'm doing doesn't mean I don't appreciate your help. All right, we're going to add extra pressure this time. I like that this dude's a little bit fuzzy because he reminds me of um, my puppies. Doesn't matter. I want to try to make this. Uh, what's up, JJ? I'm trying to make this font a little bit bigger on here. Like you would think that if you stretch it out or make it full screen, that you can make it like that size. That's how big I want that font. <laughs> that would be awesome if we can do that.
have made Bumblebee. Right then. Step two. Where are we going to put our big hex? We're going to do some smaller ones as well. Loving it so far. Yes, Lisa? in your head. So in order to keep it true to what I've been doing, it's going to have to be all of the colors, because that's, that's my oh, style. You, yeah. Lisa, you'll have to ask. Let me see. I'll have to read that, because I'm not. Erica does all that stuff. What's the question? She said, at Carrie Hicks, the white cell over the top means lay your colors down first and put white cell next to colors, then you swipe. Swipe over your CV colors and vice versa. Sounds like they're telling Carrie Hicks those things. Huh? Yeah, that's what, that's what I'm saying. She's telling Carrie how to do it. Carrie, you know you can always text me as well. Okay, let's get some things down. I'm going to start with blacks and yellows and golds, but I'm pretty sure it's not going to take long before I just throw all of the colors at this piece. So that's just a heads up for y'all. Go ahead and open them. I'm 
I'm using a number of colors from a number of brands, so if you want to know specifically what color I'm using, ask me. But I'm using Jacquard, Marabou, Copic, Ranger, Zig, and Tim Holtz. So, let's do the black and yellow first. Get that out of the way. So, black, yellow, black, yellow, black, yellow. Just drenching my image. I'm going to drop various... Welcome, Angela Mendoza. Yellows and blacks. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, abort, abort, abort. Let's soak up some of this black. It's too much. Yeah, I was going to say, babe, you're like... It's going too hard in the paint. I thought you, you probably should just do... I'll probably need to just do the black with the paint pen. That's going to eat up all of my... Everything. Okay. Proceed. Let's drop some gold in there too. Gold I'm using is Rich Gold by Jacquard. There's that ball bearing that was searching for. because you guys know I'm really awesome at spilling um, my alcohol ink. It's okay if things get kind of crazy out in this peripheral area because I'm going to um, I'm going to add multiple other colors as well. Catherine wants to know, I'm just wondering, do you know when you will have the acrylic geodes and clear round panels back in stock? Those are definitely a favorite of people. <laughs> What are you laughing at? Are you laughing at my bee? <laughs> Stop laughing at my bee! It looks like an egg on the screen. Well, it's not. It's going to be amazing. Just give me a second. Beatrice is going to be beautiful. Beatrice? Yeah, Beatrice the bee. What I would do, I would take the, uh, I would take alcohol. I love the top. It looks like a bee. Like it, it, it looks like the shape of a bee. And not an egg. I don't understand why people are doing these weird. You guys just try to stick to, uh, Regular font. Just so regular font. Don't do fancy. Don't do. It won't um, populate. Don't, don't do the these hundred thumbs up. Um, we appreciate that, but it it it's not letting it show, and then we have to either show it or hide it, um, and then we don't want people to think, oh, we're not letting you type or show you stuff. Like, just type regular. Um, if you have a question, 
keep it simple and short and do capital so you can see it, but just refrain from all the crazy fonts and all the emojis and stuff. A lot of emojis. You can you can still put emojis out there. YouTube will just flag it. We're trying to help avoid that for you guys. Are you going to give me a pointer? Or? Angela Mendoza says, Oh my gosh, I've been trying to come up with a name of my YouTube channel and self in general and everything I come up with because someone has. Yeah, that's, that's, that's quite... Uh, quite frustrating so you, you might have to come outside the box and you don't necessarily have to you know use what you do in your name try not to don't you know don't yourself. use crafts or DIY or artsy or resin or you know what you do just come up with something that's you know that's unique to you and you know maybe an old nickname or an old password to something or just something fun and you know um robin robin says hi all jeff i have well is stone coat art coat food safe so here's the thing about resin and food safety. Um, Stone Coat Art Coat is one of the resins that is highest rated for food safety by the FDA, but there is no resin that's completely 100% food safe. The best you can get with resin is quick contact or incidental contact uh, FDA food safe. So what that means is you shouldn't use it for like a cheese tray, something that's going to be in contact with the resin for a prolonged period of time. Don't lick resin. In summation. not even airbrush cam right here. Once it, it once it is fully cured, it is totally food safe. Is that a question? No, somebody said that. I don't know if that's true. Trina, I I'm I'm not sure if that it says that right on the Stone Coat own website. Okay. I would message Mike Quist and ask him about that. That's not something that I'm aware of, but... Soul Minded Creations Mike. What's up, Mike? We are What's not... What's name? The, um... Trina. Mm. 
not the end all be all on resin. We're not the authority by any means. No, well, that sounds like an awesome, <laughs> an awesome surprise. Trina's dad brought her three airbrushes with a mini compressor. Oh, hey. That's great. <laughs> I have absolutely no clue how to use it. Um... <laughs> Um, I will. Soon. I'll, I'll have some up. I'm going to add the color now, but I'm scared. What is it? Today's Thursday, right? Friday's just tomorrow, Mike. You're right around the corner, bud. That's fun, it's almost just like a, like an abstract bumblebee, you know, like, mm -hmm. looking at it on here, if you walk by, you'd go, look at that bumblebee, like you would. Yeah, quick glance. Yeah. I would love to see, but this is just me, because you know I love to. Like I'll do some flow stuff. I'll do some of that. Right now I'm wondering if I should add the um, my all of the colors or leave it a certain color palette. Do it outside the thing. You know it stays out if you just put the stuff down. Right? Like put it down and then get a brush, like a big brush like this. Um and just, can you just, like, push it along the side line, like, along the line and then down, like, so that you're pushing it outside of the, I don't know what that is. Are you going to, it's kind of stiff, you might want to. It'll be fine. I mean, I hope that works. I don't know if it will work. But. Well, we'll find out together. It's not good. How is that so blown out? And that sucks because I don't have just the... airbrush scene.
There's so many different like What's up, Arlene? Robin Edwards says, hello, my first time seeing you live. You guys are amazing. Thank you, Robin. Hey, Robin. Welcome, Robin. This is ATD. I'm trying to get a good angle for you guys. For this bumblebee, but we have all of these uh, It's a little wonky because of the shadows. I'm not a fan of these shadows. that camera this way and that way. Yeah, let it go. No, don't move it. Down and then towards this way. Right there. Because in that way it's now it's like very you can see. Robin Edwards is in Virginia. Awesome. I think we have a couple people here that are from Virginia.
try to wipe up the majority of this because the yellow kind of took over and made it a little bit not cute. But I'm going to let this marinate. See, that's super fun. And can't you take alcohol and like, you know, run out? Like, if you wanted to, like, it, it's it's fine the way it is. I don't mind it going over it. Uh, but yeah, it's a little bit more difficult with like the pink. I just want to do like a black. Board. Oh yeah, a black cradle board with gold leaf. It's a bumblebee like negative space thing. Just do just the gold parts. It looks great. Sharon Harrison, how are you? <laughs> well, hey, we may need to talk. Hi, Senior Helper. I lurk constantly, watch all the ATD videos. These guys are pretty real. We try. All right, not digging this, so I'm gonna. Um, they're from Art, um, Don and. Where are they from? Happy, no, surprise. What's it called? What? what I don't know where they're from. Where they're from? Art by Carter, Catter. They're in like, they're in the Phoenix area. Phoenix area. Chandler. Ocean, what's up? Alright. Get to getting on this. Yeah? Yeah. So that other stuff is not going to matter that
Ocean, that would be awesome. She says, I want to do some ocean animals like turtle, fish, etc. Do a fun seahorse. That would be fun. Jellyfish. Jellyfish would be awesome for something like this because it's so squishy and alcohol inky. Yeah, it's already so fluid. It would look into the that and over that and up and then just kind of fade off that way yeah and then maybe have that go down the line of that and then fall off into the other side of down that. the back side yeah yeah Welcome, Gianna, Gianna, G-I-A-N-N-A. What's up, Lisa? How are you? Hello. JJ, you better get on that. <laughs> he says, probably going to end up in the same building as Jeff and Erica until I find a job in a house near my job. Pretty good building. Thing. I'm going 
going to bring this down this way, and after this sets up, I'm going to fade this outward, and I'll fade this downward, in theory. Twisted, she's out. You're out by Trader's Village, huh? Thank you. Same to you, Polly. I love it that all, all these new people are saying hi and and uh, talking. Yeah, we've got a couple. We've got a couple people from Colorado. Uh, senior helpers from Colorado. Sandy, Sheila McGowan. I could go on. Jeff, have you seen an apart slash industry building downtown with a Ferrari painted on the front garage? I don't know. With the Ferrari. I, I don't know. I've seen a lot of a lot of garage doors, but I don't know. I haven't seen a Ferrari painted on one. If you have a if you have a picture of it, send it to ATD's poor people. to lift the color but it's fine. It looks so fun. See I love it. When people just get out there and say where they're from and and and, uh, and say what's up, you get so many more you never know who's out there. You never know where people are. All up in here making friends. Holly Miller says, Erica, you are brilliant with the alcohol ink girl. There are many times where I feel not brilliant, but I really appreciate you saying that. Yeah, we just live like five minutes, about five, driving about two minutes, walking about seven to ten minutes from Farmer's Market. It's just on the other side of the freeway. And I still, I don't know where there's a Ferrari. Can't think of one. And the 
attempt to fade these colors though. Not always the best at fades, but we'll see what happens. He is unhappy about the high rise coming up across the street. Yeah, there's so many big buildings. Whoa. that going inside the honeycomb uh, David that that's that's just a part of it like you would have to put some either masking fluid or tape down to completely do that or you could paint it like you said which is a good idea um, thank you Clara thank you very much Clara. Vance in the house. Hey, um, What she'll probably do, David, is um, she still has to get the... Uh, I'm pretty sure she's going to put some gold leaf down um, and some black lines. So all that stuff will be a little bit more relevant here pretty soon. Right now all we're doing is blocking the colors. Trying to fade out these edges on the end so they kind of make a little Shelley. bit more sense. Okay, Shelly. And if you guys are new and haven't heard this sound, that means somebody has donated to us. It's not necessary, but if you would like to hear that sound, you are more than happy to. <laughs> we appreciate any and all donations. You see, receiving enough video to maintain smooth streaming, such as viewers will be a, What? How is it not? It's like, is it, uh... Is it buffering for you guys? Terry Edwards, hi from Vegas. Welcome. We love to hear from Vegas. Yeah, I have this like little notification on the uh, on the edit screen. It says, YouTube is not receiving enough video to maintain smooth streaming, such as viewers, such as viewers will experience buffering, maybe, I don't know. These blues aren't really fading out, so I may have to add a little bit more ink, which I'm nervous about because I'm okay with the balance of everything. Thank you. Thank you, Nene, for putting that up there. See, you're just like... You're just like a natural, Nene, with that little wrench. And if you're new to the channel and you, uh, you're, you're confused about anything or have a question, please ask it. Don't hesitate. Um, if we don't answer it, somebody in the, in the room will. Eventually. Um, there are no stupid questions. 
Um, and if you're wondering about the people with the blue names and the wrench, they are uh, the mods, which help us out. As you can see, they can put up uh, information, websites, emails, and, and such. So if you have any questions or any requests, ask away and we will try to fulfill them. Did Bo eat all you guys' food or drink all your water? Ocean, thank you very much. Sherry Edwards wants to know, are you guys going to do a YouTube class with alcohol inks? So, it's possible. I just, I don't fancy myself as a very skilled alcohol ink person. But if you guys want me to, I can, for sure. You guys let me know what you guys want and I will make it happen. How about that? Happy to facilitate. That's all I like. Cascade. Cascade's doing a live performance from the Grand Canyon Skywalk right now, you guys. Go look at... Uh... Oh my gosh, that's so rad. Coke Studio Session, Cascade Live from Grand Canyon Skywalk. That is pretty amazing. Thank you, Kim. That's very kind of you. My this. I'm just gonna try to shape our little dude up a little bit. She said, love this piece. Rittenhouse. Kim Rittenhouse, Kim? pour my heart. Pouring my heart. Okay.
do the major outlining of the um, yellow with gold. That would make more sense. Gail Ward wants to know what is the marker you're using? This is a Posca pen. Where are you? Are you here? No. Um, are you here? Yeah, you're overhead. Here. Um, and then Gail Ward says, what is the, oh no, 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 she just asked that. Nancy Richard says, the white board paint primer, pen or acrylic? Maybe, maybe the. Bowie oh, is having a time. He's just by himself on the bed and Wednesday's like, what are you doing in here? What's going on, Bowie? You got Wednesday's attention. <laughs> we'll see you, Arlene. <laughs> Come on, Bowie. can't see me in chat. What's up with that? Who? We can. Kim, we can see you in chat. We've responded to your question so far, Kim.
Shane said, you need to get Jen and Clara and Vamp and do an AI class again. Oh, that would be so much fun. Says we can only see Kim if she donates. But I thought you were seeing her comments earlier. Was that only on a donation? Didn't we see that? I thought we did. Did we not see Kim's um, name? We made a comment about Rittenhouse. It wasn't too long. Yeah, I wonder if that was just when she commented. I don't know. That's strange. I don't. I don't know why we wouldn't be able to see her. Because I have it on live chat. Live chat. We have it on live chat. Is that uneven? Is that board uneven or something? No. I got my little cups moved. Angela Mendoza says, has anyone tried alcohol inks and dishwasher safe Mod Podge? I'm wondering if the alcohol inks will disappear. Huh. I haven't tried it. Um, Kim, are you... Are you subscribed to our... She is. Okay. She's the one that had to message me one time to say that her comments weren't showing. And I... I don't know. That's so weird. <sighs> Fujo, what are you doing? Are you just hanging out? Can you go see your mama out there? Oh. <laughs> get him, Bowie. Get him. Get him, Bowie. Please get him. Get your brother. Get him. Let's go up here. Turn it over. Such a cutie tootie. Good 
stencil. You're going to spray it gold. You want to use gold or what do you think? Try the, um... Look at your cat behind you. <laughs> oh, <laughs> when he got so big. I do want to use the stencil to do some gold. Enough babies. Honey Let's get the gold out. Yeah, we're JJ, we're about ready to get it out right now. Get what out? The stencil. Purple handy. Purple? Should I block off the honeycombs from going inside of this or just let it happen? Tracy Creations. Oh. Tracy Creating. How are you? That's a new name. Welcome, Tracy. Hello, Debbie. What do you think, B? That's where. Whoa. That's Ron's. Uh, I set yours and Ron's for different. Should I allow it to come into this or? Yeah, a little bit. Why not? What? legs bees have? I'm just going off the reference. How many legs do bees have? Six. Well, I only have four. Well, maybe you can't see the others. Who's saying that? Clara sent me a text. Clara, calm down. We gotta be all specific. I guess I'm gonna have to do another one. Another couple legs. But look, my little Dude, no, only they're like hiding. Two. And two. I'll go in and add a couple more legs. Everybody chill. So what are you going to do here? I don't know. Thinking about heavier to lighter, but I'm not sure. Yeah. And not all of it, but like just fade it a little. Do this to make it fun. Do this, hold on. Here, it's here. You're gonna, what you're gonna do is cover up some of that uh, some of that honeycomb. And, and make it to where it's it's on here and it goes past this, but it'll be kind of solid. And then maybe come down here, and then maybe come this way and just hit it so it's solid in here, right? You know what I'm saying? Kinda. No. Mm -hmm. 
tag you in for that because I don't. I covered the bee with the piece of paper. Yeah, I think that's the litter box. Hey y'all, hey y'all, hey y'all. This. Kim, I'm, I'll try to figure out what's going on. I don't know. That that really has... Like, it sucks because it has nothing to do with us. Like, we don't... We I don't know. Know. Right, Vamp? I had no idea how many legs the bees have. Linda says, your bee has been through stuff. He's missing a couple legs, okay? It's not a handicap. I think he'll get by. Hey, Nene. Yeah, JJ, I contacted YouTube on her behalf already, but YouTube seems to be taking their sweet, sweet time responding to the things. Agreed, Sherry. Learn something new every day. Masking it off in the first place if you're just gonna put them. Huh? I'm confused. No, this is not a magic show. Seems like. So I want some of it to come in here. Okay. We're just using big sheets of paper to um, mask off certain areas. Anytime there's a flying thing in here, I'm like, Ermagerd, it's another killer grasshopper. However, I don't think that's the case right, right now. I'm so sorry about your mom's passing 19 years ago, Miss Lisa. I definitely am going to call this be Beatrice. And that makes sense. But, um, Lisa finds, um, Kim is definitely messaging from the YouTube app because she donated, and I'm pretty sure that you can't do that via the Facebook. Pretty sure. I don't know, but I'm pretty sure. And I was going to do it on the other side as well to kind of fade out because the side you're doing right now doesn't have a very good fade out and so I was going to use the honeycomb as a that blend I don't know Nene I've been trying to come up with a name for the the dragonfly I don't know if it's a boy or a girl or maybe something like I was kind of leaning towards a uni name like um, Danny. 
Agreed, Lisa. Kim, I see you. I see your regular comment, Miss Kim. Holly received her amazing COVID print yesterday. Thank you so much. Tell Jeff I love it. Thank you. I think it's a girl. I agree. Nay, nay. Kim, I see your yay. What did you do so I can help other people? It's so funny. Everyone's like, Kim! Switch to counts. Okay. Thank you, Catherine. She says, I love the way this piece is coming out. So vibrant. I love the honeycomb accents. Honeycomb is something that Jeff and I have really been drawn to. Looks great. What do you think about adding just a couple in the... It would be the top? Right here? Yeah. Just a couple just on the inside corner. <clears throat> like fading more, yeah. Inside of it? Yeah. Just a couple. Because it's a little bit void on the outside. <sighs> What do you mean on the outside? No, I like what you're doing. I just want to add just a couple. Jeff is deep in concentration. Yes, he is. Kim's name is different. Oh, okay, I didn't know what it was earlier. Oh, it's her business account. Well, I'm just glad you're a hint here, Kim. No one should have to pay $1.99 just to comment, so. I'm happy you're here. I'm happy it's working. I don't know what the deal is on your other account. I assure you, you're not blocked in any way. That is super fun. Been here just lurking. I'm just glad you're here in any capacity. All right, where's the sticky pen? Where's the sticky? Okay, I found it. Okay. Ooh, looks even better in person, y'all. Wes is up there, so he's gonna spin that REP. I think I wanna go up there. We should go up there after. So I'm going to be using the deco foil sticky pen. That's not what it's called. It's not called a sticky pen. It's called an adhesive pen. It's by iCraft. Deco foil adhesive pen. Where but I think, huh? Where are you going to do it at? I'm going to start by adding it to the yellow. Because I didn't really outline the yellow bits in black. I'm going to do it with the sticky pen. Just call it a sticky pen. That's not what it in real life is called, just so you guys know. Alright, I'm gonna I'm gonna put this up close for right now and then I'm gonna this. Cujo, calm down. Will you, for two seconds, get, stop, 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 turn around. Oh God, I, I just saw him. I'm like, what is he? Y'all, <laughs> look at this guy. He just jumped to her back. Like, that's what he's supposed to be doing. What is he looking at? Probably all these little flies. <laughs> that was not a good thing. Oh, wow. Sorry about that. Anybody out there want a cat? Anybody out there want a cat? <laughs> Not a good 
Not really, but almost. Now, let's see, watch, I'll put him, I took him out of the area, and every time I do that, he'll always come back just to see, like, oh, yeah, what, now I really want to be over here. Think you could stop me? Get him, Bowie. That little boy cat is definitely a shoulder cat. Did they see what happened? Um, no. I just showed him. said, nope, he belongs with you too. <laughs> I'm going to be real with you guys. That hurt just a little bit. Oh my God, they're crazy right now. Like, they're in that really weird psycho, they've done some drugs kind of crazy cat, like they a feral. They their ears and get like, rogue. It's crazy how they almost get mean, but it's zoomy. Real sweet, but also mean. Tim said, if I had a thousand dollars, I'd buy this. Um, well, if you, if you had a thousand dollars, we would sell it to you. <laughs> it, it won't be a thousand dollars. Unless we do a bidding war and Laura comes in here. Then you guys she are done. She just bought a brand new like, <laughs> RV that's like extra knocked out. Bowie. No, I'll blow. Thirty-six minutes. Evelyn, time for play is whenever they're awake. It doesn't matter if it's nine thirty at night or four, between three and five a.m. That's when they play the hardest. And on the bed, they're never in the bedroom ever, ever, ever. I guess that's our fault for having a loft and no doors except for the bathrooms. Oh my God, they're both crazy right now. She's doing the thing too. Oh, yep. Oh God, <laughs> cliffhanger, <laughs> cliffhanger. Sit, quiet, make it. <laughs> Bowie, what are those guys doing? Bowie, get your cats. Oh my God, yeah, they're yours. I'm about to put this like awesome foil on the wings. Cindy Stevens said, children are having a party tonight. I suppose.
You need some scissors for an exacto. That. Oh my goodness, I can't remember which end is which. Hmm? What are you doing? To do the, yeah. the peel off. Use it. Donna, um, I literally just ordered some today off Amazon. They're only like three, three and a half by three and a half inches, like square. So they're pretty small. But I had no idea that there was black um, gold leaf. The black gold leaf or is 19 black, like, year old cat foil leaf wow that's impressive Claire I have a 14 year old cat What is this voodoo you are doing? I'm trying to make the wings iridescent. Which you probably could with just a very thin layer of metallic paint, because you know metallic paint. If this works like it is in my head. Are you gonna are you it. gonna are you sticking it down and then you're gonna cut it out or is it gonna stick you gonna peel it off? Scratch it. Uh -huh. mm, okay. They don't sleep. They sleep some. They don't sleep as much as they used to. Ocean. So I rough scribbled some um, of that adhesive pen down on this. I'm just gonna do a little bit of extra just to be sure the back of this paintbrush. Thank you for the thumbs up. Glitter glass, they want to know if you're going to resin over it. Did it work? Yeah, it's just super faint. So now I want to like make it do more. Let go of me. Now it's got more potential than this. Erica, this is so amazing, really, really awesome. Lisa. Thank you. We just need to let it dry some.
It might not be coming off on that pin as fast as you were doing that. Unless you could see it. We'll see you, Vamp. Good night. Thanks for joining. We got 80 people watching. Thank you very much. Hit that like button. If you're new or if you're just now watching and uh, you haven't subscribed, please do so. We would really appreciate that. Um, we are trying to get to that 50 K subscribers we're at 37 right now I believe so which is amazing Janine said I just had a guy fit a new shower sc screen and showed him my studio he bought a piece of art Dude, that's amazing that's awesome you might want to just leave that on there too like let it dry a little and then mm -hmm. take it off Maynard says it's here in Canada, Vancouver, it's 7.49 evening. Awesome. It is 9.39 p.m. here in Dallas, Texas. It's only 4.30 here where Ocean's at. Wow. Is it really that back? Hawaii, is that much of a difference? Huh. I did not know that. Such a yo-yo. This one is backwards. What's that? This one is backwards. These things have to be done a certain way. If you do it upside down, it won't... Um, Twelve thirty nine in Brisbane. Awesome. Excuse me. Bless you. Thank you. So if you put this down upside down, nothing will happen. It has to be done a certain way. That cat really it up my back. I can feel it. Yeah, one day I'll do my, uh, or we will do our 24-hour live feed. It would be perfect to do that now so that we can have time slots for people to come so that we don't have a bunch of people in the, same, in the room at the same time. Yep. sure if that pin is working. It is. I can see it. I just put this stuff down upside down. Okay. Mommy, 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 mattress. Much better. Jacqueline is currently pouring a layer one of a large round for a wedding present. Presence is so fun. You guys give me just a second, I'll show you what it is I'm doing. 
probably can't really see it from the Show you what it looks like, and I think I'm gonna add just a little bit more of a different color. Hold on. What camera am I on? Well, I'll do overhead, but I'll uh, make it so it's better. Overhead needs to be. can see it. Can you see on there? It's too sideways. I think. Um, yeah, you can see it. It just, it looks different in person though. So fun! Look, it's picking it up. Mm -hmm. See, you can tell it's picking it up because it's like patchy. See? Yeah. I do. What do you think, Bowie? You can see what you want to do right here. Who cares? This stuff definitely works better when you just pick a little spot and add a little pressure instead of like laying it out full like I was doing with the gold leaf. How magical, now I wanna do a fairy. Actually, it looks like wings. Alright, here's your this. How trashy would it look if I outlined a couple of these in black? Probably trashy. Just a couple. Yeah, don't do that. Because okay. your, your hand isn't like you've. Mm -mm. <laughs> no. <laughs> 
do the uh, airbrush camera to your left, please. It's for fingernails, not sure what it's called. I think they're asking about that. What? About your stuff there. I like it. This? I yeah. This. Um, I think I just looked up nail foil on that place. Nail foil. Beautiful nail on um. What is the place? Oh, Amazon. JJ says, my nephew hasn't gotten a don't mess with Texas lips. Can you send me a tracking info? You should be getting that. Yeah, it should be. You should be getting that any day. I'm just darkening in some of these parts with black alcohol ink. Now I'm super self conscious about not having enough legs. We'll see you, Ocean. Have a good night. Thanks, Ocean. Thank you very much. Should I add more legs or just be like creative uh, license? I just don't know where they go. Like on here, they look they look a little bit larger than the hind ones. Ashworth, where where are you? Australia. Mm -hmm. She says she hasn't arrived. Her name hasn't arrived yet either. Susie Q. It's on the way too. That one just yeah, sent every, out. All of them are sent out. Hopefully they didn't get lost or stolen or being held up somewhere. So it takes a little bit longer to get through customs, so. We just got a bunch of uh, bunch of stock yeah. in. Um, how do you say that? G I A N N A. Gianna. Gianna. We just got some just resin. Um, what else did we get? Just resin, resin art, and stone coat all came in. Yeah, we just got all of that in. Do you have any scratches? Yeah. Yeah, you do. Not you. Also you, but not you. Now. To drizzle or not drizzle? So right now what I'm doing is just fading out some of this black and making it look a little bit more watercolory. Change that I need to hang that next to the lady I have at Jeff's art. You can have it. You can be the lucky Purchase. winner. Purchaser. Should I do drippies or no? No. Maybe drippies 
So if it's displayed like this, like I would, I would just leave it. I wouldn't put any more too busyness. Yeah. I can't even get over these wings. It looks good. <sighs> Y'all. All right, let's get resonating. First things first is we need to seal it. Dead. Gum it. And now that, I don't know if you're going to be able to do that with the gold. Just spray I'm it on something. I'm going to selectively seal it. Well, let's try it again. No, because other stuff, it might be different on there. Okay, so I'm just going to selectively seal hey. it. What? What does it look like? Is it that? Yeah. So I'm just going to selectively seal it in these parts. Spray it, and then we'll just put the stencil back down and just hit it with the gold again. What about your gold leaf? It's on there very... It doesn't look like it does anything to the gold leaf. Okay. Alright, so we'll just go back over it with the gold. Yes. I'm going to try to be selective and see what happens. Activate when the resin hits it. I don't know. I'm just not going to worry about it. If this kind of fades it a little bit, it's not going to. It's not the end of the world. My this is still vibrant. I'm just going to run with it. For all you children at home. Spray seal before you add any embellishments. Wednesday. Don't be going to sleep. No obvious anymore. Seal it with. I am using UV Archival. This is the matte UV Archival. Very important to get the matte. I don't know if it's focusing. Just know that this is what it is. This is what it looks like. It's by Krylon Gallery Series. But you have to have the matte because the um, gloss will reactivate your uh, alcohol inks. That would be no bueno. While this is drying, I'm going to start mixing my resin.
resin I'm using tonight is going to be a Stone Coat Art Coat. It's by Stone Coat Countertops. It is the Art Coat version of it. I do carry it on my website, artistillnet.com. Um, this is a 24 inch. So I'm going to use. I'm going to use almost seven ounces. Whoops. It is a two part resin, which means it is equal parts, well, equal amounts of both parts. This is a very user friendly epoxy. That came out to six ounces. Probably not enough, so I'm going to push it up. Jerry three. gets his own bathroom. <laughs> push it up to seven. Are talking to Laura? Uh, I just saw her, her comments on her page. I aspire to have an RV one day that we can just travel around and teach our classes. goals right there. Anyways. So uh, this resin is super awesome because it gives you a two hour working time which isn't really that big a deal on this piece because we're not doing any design work with it. But if you were going to do a countertop or a large painting this would be super ideal and it is what we use. Um, it's the best UV resistance I've found. It's the highest heat resistant I've found, which is 500 degrees Fahrenheit. It's chemical resistant, water resistant, almost goof resistant, if we're being really real about it. Um, it has no odor to me. Um, it is FDA approved for incidental contact which is the highest FDA food rating you can get for an epoxy. Um, also, keep in mind if you're looking for something that's food safe, um, anything you add to it, like a pigment, even if it's a pigment made for resin, changes the chemistry of it no matter what resin you're using. And so you're gonna need to do a flood coat if you add any kind of pigment to your art layer. Um, most resins really like to be worked in a mid-70s dry temperature climate. Stone coat is also one of those. Um, in terms of personal protection equipment or PPE, use your judgment or the judgment of a physician. I cannot advise you either way. I'm not wearing a respirator because I'm in a very well ventilated open space and also you wouldn't be able to hear me if I had a ventilator on or a respirator. But um, that's not to say you shouldn't or should. I'm just saying use your best judgment. If you have any kind of reaction, talk to your medical professionals. Don't get on Dr. Google or Dr. Facebook for resin or medical advice. Typically, you're supposed to mix this quantity for about three minutes. You really want everything to be well incorporated, so both part A and part B are mixed together uh, fully. So that means scraping the sides of your mixing cup and the bottom and your stir stick. There's nothing more heartbreaking than having a piece that you love that doesn't set properly. My very first piece was like that. It's a heartbreaker. Still haven't gotten over it. I'm wondering. This is bothering me for some reason.
Beatrice, I think you are a beautiful bumblebee. But this resin is going to make you even more stunning. Is everyone good in YouTube land? Yeah, she is still. They're worried about your wet spot. What wet spot? It's probably just shiny, you guys, from the spray. They say that there's a wet spot from the UV spray. Where? Well, you probably already poured over it. I don't know. Maybe. So we'll see how important that is. just learn together, shall we? We shall. This is dry. This is dry, so well, that's all the checking. I love how vibrant resin makes everything. That really made the bumble wings light up too. So resin is self-leveling. You don't have to make sure that it's the same amount of resin across your whole piece. Your only job at this point is to make sure there's no dry spots, to make sure there's no bubbles and no hairs, and also to make sure that when you set it to, uh, when you leave it to set up, that there's, it's level. Because if it's uneven, you're risking everything running off into the abyss. Roxy, there is gold leaf in it. It's just, it's just not a lot. <clears throat> Let me just hit some heat on this and I'll give you a close up of where all the gold leaf and all the little accents are. All that stuff is still working. And everybody's gonna start saying moist. Why are we dropping the M word? <laughs> You don't want to use too much heat because you don't want your resin to thin out because that will open it to run all the way off your piece. You just want to pop the bubbles. That is it. Looks great. Thank you, Tony the Tiger. So what camera am I on so I can show them? I will, sh I will go overhead. Right. Uh, you can really see the gold. Right, okay. Yeah, right the here. leaves, the, that surely shows up now too. We'll take a, crew, a true color video. Yeah, I'll leave it out for a true color. No 
know what we're going to price this bed be at, but um, she will be available. Can see your phone? Oh, you want to do it? Do you use the camera or the flash? Probably would look nice with the flash. Everybody says it's beautiful, beautiful. Cool bananas. Holly needs a timeout because she started the M word. We can put you in timeout. We can really make that happen. Anybody with a uh, wrench next to them? Congratulations on successfully leaving negative space. That's what we're all about. The only negative that we like in this household. I want to go put Beatrice up in the dust. Is there, a, is there a room? Have you looked? The only thing that was in there was... Um, Just breathe. You're going to have to uh, do the buys on a different screen because they don't have it over there. Oh, uh, hold on. We have flipped off. There we go. You get the back of me, of us. That's the best. Never mind. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. All right. Thanks, everybody. You guys are awesome. If you're interested in this, um, I'm not sure how much she's going to sell this for. Um, probably in the fours. Maybe, because this is a pretty large piece, pretty amazing. Um, so yeah, here, here she is. Here's the artist. Can we get a round of applause? Hey, you're up there. Just <laughs> trying to see if I had any scratches. He jumped from the couch. I knew he was watching you too. He was like, he was just looking up there. So that's all he was concentrating on. I can feel them, like they're wealthy. 
What's your hand? I can, I can, I can imagine. Mm. They were like, it showed blood. Thank you. What? Man. I heal like a corpse. Mm. OMG, Erica. Hey, Evelyn. So anyways, you guys, thanks for watching and seeing what we're up to today. I am super pumped about how well Beatrice turned out. Beatrice. Yeah. Beatrice. Tablet just decided to restart. Well, I'm glad you're still here, Linda. Thank you, Brooke and Nene and JJ. Um, I gotta take the boys out before they pee on my shoes. I see Cujo, like, look at yeah, him. He's like glaring from the top. He's like, I can hear her, kind of. I don't know if you guys can see him, but he is right in here. And he's gonna run down and off this couch in just a second. So you guys, thank you so, so much for coming in and seeing what we are up to today. Yeah, wash those scratches, but you know, I'll put some alcohol on there if you need. Sweet, let's make it burn. All right, let's boogie. This was Be two evil. hour and 20 minutes. That's what she said, Nene. Anyways, you guys, thank you so, so much for watching us and seeing what we're up to today. If you have any requests, shoot me a text at 214-402-9996. Read all of these, the, the, these things. Do, 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 do. do. Do, 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 do. And don't forget that you should be part of us on our Pour With Us Live on the 25th of this month. You can get the kit on our website, artistilldeath.com. Just type in Pour With Us and it'll bring up the kit or just use what you already have. It may also probably also work too, also. Yes. Um, just tune in with us. You know, just breathe, bro. He's scary. He's crazy right now. He is. He's gone rogue. So I gotta take the boys out and we will see you guys manana. Thank you so so much for watching. We love you guys. Be kind to one another. You never know what someone's going through. Just be sweet. That's all I gotta do. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. I said bye. <laughs>